Right guys, I've got something to confess. Never thought to see the day. I'm back on Tinder. Dun, dun, dun. I'm back on Tinder. What has happened to me? What has happened to me? I'm back on Tinder. Like, I, I'm actually walking out of shot. I'm walking out of shot because I'm back on Tinder. Oh my gosh, and it's so awful. Main reason I'm back on Tinder is because, right, this is embarrassing again, number two embarrassment. I turned up at my ex's house last week and he rejected me, so I'm back on Tinder. <laughs> at least I'm honest. He rejected me and it was really cold and it was really nasty, but do you know what? I know now that if someone doesn't want me, then they don't want me. Someone else is gonna want me out there, so a single Scottish female, life goes on and Tinder is where I have turned to and it sucks. It's majorly sucky, like uh, it's not even a good sucky sucky, it's a bad sucky sucky. Scottish Tinder, okay, let's just go into Scottish Tinder. Now, Scottish Tinder when you're a female is full of this. One, Neds, loads of Neds, hundreds of Neds, loads of Neds with their tops off for some reason, loads of bottles of Bucky, um, loads of old Neds as well. So like, I've got quite a mix because I'm, I'm not very age judgy. Most of them drive BMWs or Range Rovers and they look like they're in that glow thing, whatever it's called, that rubbish TV show that Glaswegians are in. I'm sorry, I know somebody that's actually in it, but it does suck and the camera work is shit. You know, I'm, I'm not going to not going to be too bad. There are some attractive Neds in this world. I like a wee Ned. I'm from Paisley, come on, I'm used to Neds. I grew up with Neds, but not the ones in Tinder. Second thing is there's a lot of hipsters. I've noticed it's a, it's a very high contingency of hipsters and then there's also tr hipsters that try and sound like they're really intelligent and use big words. Like there's no reason to use big words on Tinder. Basically you're just there for one thing. Do you like the person? Yes, okay. You both think each other are attractive. Boom. Let's meet up for a drink. Okay, that's all you have to do. You don't need to start quoting the dictionary on Tinder. You do not need to start using a thesaurus to reply to text messages, there's no point. It's wasting your time and wasting mine, not interested. Just, do you want to meet up? Okay, boom, 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 meet up, boom. <sighs> Stop wasting my time. The other thing is geeks, there's lots of geeks. There's like people that look like they never come out of their house on Tinder. Like they look like the kind of guys that just like sit in the cupboard. They actually look like Harry Potter. If Harry Potter actually had to stay in his house and he wasn't a wizard for the whole, his whole life, they just look like wee geeky guys. They're like, oh, IT crowd type guys. Loads of them on Tinder the boys that would never talk to you in real life but I have so much confidence because they're behind a smartphone. I don't like them ones either. I don't, I'm so fussy. I'm, oh, I shouldn't be this fussy. I really shouldn't be this fussy but I am. Just the last thing I'm going to say about it right and I'm not, I'm, I know I'm slagging it all off and I'm on it right and see if you see me on it. I only swipe right if you feel sorry for me. <laughs> no, right, no. Uh, <laughs> Just a word of advice, right, while I'm talking about Scottish Tinder is, like, guys, topless pictures are not attractive to girls on Tinder. I am sorry, I don't care if you're a stripper, a male stripper. I don't want to see your, I don't want to see your breakfast like that. Do you know what I mean? Have a bit of dignity. I mean, I say, I stand here and say, have a bit of dignity. Yes, have a bit of dignity. It's embarrassing, honestly, and it's the most often thing. And guys are probably decent. If you put a topless picture up or like a half, you know, a headless one, ugh, ugh, nobody likes that at all, especially in Scotland. Gives you the dry oak. Yeah, so I'm on it. I've been asked. I've been asked to go on a date. I'm well aware that my mum could be outside right now, so. But I have been asked to go on a date with a pretty decent looking hipstery type boy. So, TBC. <laughs> oh, oh, look, right, here we go, right. See, I don't really like the thought of doing it, but look, if I get to 100 subscribers, I'll go on a date and I'll tell you all about it. Okay? Oh, if I must, if I must go on a date, I'll go on a date and I'll tell you all about it on here. 100 subscribers, please. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.